We're at the 2023 Big Sugar Classic right here in downtown Bentonville. Big Sugar Gravel was founded by the Lifetime team proudly in 2019. Now they're really positioning Bentonville as a center for gravel riding. And Big Sugar has proven that. There's always an event going on, group rides, gatherings. It's sort of the middle of the bike riding universe these days. So we are at Big Sugar Weekend, the day before the race, and uh, we're doing a shakeout ride. It's kind of fun seeing everyone uh, multiple times. This is pretty chill, and we're just happy you guys are here. So thanks for joining. The bike culture is like probably no other place I've ever been. I mean, it is a very positive, forward-thinking community here. If you look at all of the little pieces that go into us just putting this event on for one weekend, it's a microcosm of how this community exists on a day-to-day. -day. There's just so much pride in this becoming a place to welcome people from everywhere. I just love how like the whole area is just so intertwined into the whole community, so all the businesses, everything revolves around cycling. I mean, we got a real sense of community when you have these kind of events. You meet people from all over the country, actually all over the world. Just a great way to connect with other cyclists, other racers. Lifetime's bringing a big time production here. They're bringing a great event, and it's why 3,000 plus riders will be out there uh, tearing up dish gravel on Saturday morning. Four, three, two, one, and we are underway. Bentonville, make a little noise. Big Sugar Gravel, presented by Mazda. Excited to be back here. Uh, 104 miles for the, for the longer distance, and then the shorter distance, they're gonna be doing about 50 miles today. It's going to be a barn burner of a race. Conditions have been dry for a number of days here. Got some great chunky gravel out there. We're not going to race their race, but you get to go out there and rub, rub shoulders, rub elbows with them, uh, visit with them. And they're all real people. But once the, once the race starts, they're real racers, and we just we go out there and we just grind gravel. Yesterday morning, uh, being at Meteor Coffee, and all the pros started showing up, lining up, and I'm like, oh my God, like I'm right where they are. And it's like such a cool thing to be able to ride. Same course and you know, see see the things that they see at the way they see it. Community involved here, I don't think people realize how good of how close of friends we all are. It's been a really fun year, just making new friends and getting to be a part of this. Just no matter how we felt out there, we're like, this is so sick to get to race with women, know where we are. That was awesome. Uh, it was good, dude. It's such a relief to uh, finish off the season. We just want to continue to grow the sport of cycling, not only for the elites and the pros, but for all of you that have come and just raced this event, other events of ours around the country. Thank you, thank you, thank you for supporting us.